name is Emily Damiani and I'm the warranty administrator at Jim Click Hyundai Mazda the Automotive. Without my JT Automotive program, I would probably right now probably still be a manager at McDonald's. It definitely opened up way more doors for me than not taking it. Matthew Maddox. I am a recon technician or used car technician. Uh, I do inspections of all the cars that they take in trade and anything that they need, anything that the car needs done, I do it basically. Daryl Keppel, Parts and Service Director. The advice that I would give someone who's thinking about taking an automotive program would be that climb in as soon as possible, freshman, sophomore year, so that uh, once you identify that this is certainly something that I would be very interested in pursuing a career with, that you have enough time to also spend your junior and senior year uh, furthering your education and your experience level. When you're first coming out of high school, it's difficult to have any experience. All right, so by pursuing this automotive program at the earliest level possible in high school, it uh, provides you with the knowledge and some working skills that are a foundation for a uh, business to be able to build upon. If you have even the slightest idea of maybe taking the auto program, just take it. That first year you learn so much that you can take on for the rest of your life and it's just basic car knowledge, but you still come out with how to keep care of your car. When I started taking the automotive class, I really was excited to get up and, and go to school because of it. I just really enjoyed it a lot, and it was good for me. And so uh, nothing better than preparing yourself before you graduate from high school for your career direction. Jim Click Automotive Team currently represents over a thousand employees. And the positions within uh, are dozens, a uh, lot of attendants, readers, cashiers, service parts, collision, sales, parts drivers, courtesy shuttle drivers. These positions are typically where someone with our organization enters and then has the opportunity to uh, further their career from there. One of the hardest things to get used to in the field was definitely being a girl. It's hard to adjust how to work with mostly men and how to kind of hold your own, but it definitely teaches you skills to help you in any career that you go into that you can stand on your own and know how to pretty much stand up for yourself in a world full of men. <laughs> well, I actually started here my senior year in high school and I would come in, do some oil changes, learn about closing the shop, learn about, you know, where, what goes where, how to pull cars. You learn a lot, not just about cars. You learn pretty much the basics. Even if you just take the first year, you pretty much know how to take care of a car and keep it running. But as you move up, there's also the career race learning that I got that we wrote resumes and cover letters and everything and worked on invoices and kind of just how the shop ran. Uh, the sky is the limit, okay? Again, it's the passion that you possess within for your career. 